Your Excellency President Uhuru Kenyatta President of the Republic of Kenya and Commander in Chief of Kenya Defence Forces Your Excellency the First Lady Mama Margaret Kenyatta Your Excellency Deputy President William Ruto and Madam Your Excellency Rachel Ruto Mama Helen Kaiseri Muke wa Bibi Rafiki yangu Jendro Kaiseri Familia yote ya Maa Community Muna sambaya watu wako hapa Na wale wengine wote Ishima yenu Yani protocols observed Wale wanijui Darudia tena Na hitua Lieutenant Colonel Retired Francis Charles Mugambi General Kaiseri Was My best friend General Kaiseli was my best man in my wedding when we were in the military. General Kaiseli was my boss at the office of the president, Harambe House. Me and General Kaiseri, for 43 years, I think we have broken the record in the world. Your Excellency, Mama Kaiseri, Ntaongea machache na sita soma Niko na speech hapa Ndiyo ni malize haraka Ntaomba wisdom Na musikise njini yote Kutoka kwa kiongozi wa nchi His Excellency the President ya kwamba Juhusi tukiwa kanisani Baptist Church hapa Gong Road His Excellency the President alisema Kwa ke ni ngumu sana kusema nkaisiri ameritaya Na tena akasema Ni ngumu sana yeye Kusema nkaisiri ate ni mida jenru I buy that wisdom Kama rafiki yake Na kwamba Jenru nkaisiri kama alikuwa minister wa interior And coordination of national government Yeye ni four star general na akiwa four star general sisi kwa jeshi tunasema generals do not die they fade and general kaiseri has not died he has faded away fade ni kusema ya kwamba kama njini ya pana wana kaiseri hapa kajiabu sabi ya mtuatafuta ye naro Mahali hapo kwa hewa Au samburu Au laikipia Mutu wa mpata That's how generals are Hata general mulingi Did not die Mukienda mutomo Sabi ya kitui huko Au muende ukase Mutapata general mulingi Because generals do not retire And did not die Turudi Nifubisha maneno Mimi na General Nkaiseri Ni Anthony 73 Two young Gentlemen Tulikutana AFTC na Kuru Mimi na Ngaria Nkaiseri Kwa macho Tall young man Slim Macho yake ni Amorani Kutoka Masailand Nikapenda ye Nkaiseri ya kanyangalia Macho, kijana, mwope, stall, slim, hako na afro, kutoka meru. Haka nipenda. Vile tunasemanga na kimombo, mimi na jedro nkaiseri, it's love at first sight. Wakati tunayendelea na cadet training, Kadet training ni ngumu sana It's the most hardest thing An officer can do Tulikuwa na kimbia 10 kilometers Kutoka FTC na kuru Kwenda Dondori 
ndio tulikuwa 90 na tulimaliza 20 sasa kwa hiyo ndio ndio Kaiseri yeye anakimbia hako mbele mambo ya maradhi ya jamii Kaiseri haijaanza leo ni zamani mimi najua uko kwetu hatuna watu wa marathon mimi niko nyuma na kuja pole pole na because we are 90 tukiendelea hivyo mimi nitatolewa sasa Kaiseri anaenda anasimama au ni mimi anakuja anakamata mimi na pia mimi weka bidii weka bidii because we are friends hata kimi inafukuzwa ndio tulipendana anasukuma mimi anasukuma mimi na hata mimi nimefika katikati ya hiyo kama for number 45 hapo na ukiwa number one ukiwa number one unaongezewa max ya ku qualify ukiwa misho tukirudi kwa kambi huko FTC ama kwa mara unasema huyu aende nyumbani sasa ngesera huko anataka mimi naenda nyumbani tunaenda tena naona mimi nimerudi nyuma tena kidogo kama namba 50 anasimama anarudi nyuma tena anasukuma mimi tena nabakia kitu kama namba 30 sasa yeye anakimbia tena ni mtu wa marathon anaongoza tena yapata ile max nikaenda sikufukuswa kaiseri akapata extra mark kufika FTC tukamaliza kade ame commanda alikuwa anajua mimi na Jerome Kaiseri we are friends akatupeleka kikosi moja one kia na njuki yani tunakuta General Mohamed akiwa na cheo ile niko naye saa hii ya Lieutenant Kano General Mohamed alikuwa anajua mimi na Jerome Kaiseri ni mapacha akatupeleka tena kampuni moja kampuni moja si company mimi na Bait Platinum Commander Kaiseri na Bait na Madani na Platinum Commander following morning kulikuwa kwa na vita ya Ugaden in Mandera Jeno Mohamed akasema wewe na wewe wale wengine wakabaki kambi wewe na Kaiseri mnaenda Mandera hata tulikunywa chai ya Barat tukaingia ndege paka Mandera mimi Kaiseri ndio huyo marikamari top tip ya Ethiopia na na Kenya. Mimi ndio huyo Lemore na Roba karibu na Banisa. Na mimi naye na na, na, na batoni yangu huko. Watu wa Somalia walikuwa na cross, wanaenda wanafika watu wetu, wanaunga watu wetu wanachukua ngamia. Wakienda Ethiopia. Watu wa Ethiopia wanakuja wana cross border ndio yaja, wanakuja tena wanapiga watu wetu wanaua, wanachukua ngamia. Tulipigana huko miezi sita. Mimi na General Kaiseri. Tukarudi tukiwa hai. Mpaka na nyuki tena kutoka hapo ni promotion. Tukakuwa lieutenant siku moja. Tukakuwa captain siku moja. Tukakuwa major siku moja. Tukakuwa lieutenant colonel siku moja. Hii si maajabu. Tajaribu sana kukubisha lakini story yangu na Kaiseri inataka kitabu. Sasa turudi hapa 1978. 1978 msana wangu akamaliza college. Huko Meru nikajua vijana huko watanyang'anya mimi tukiwa msituni. Sasa nikasema automatically hakuna kutafuta best man. Jeno ngaisere tu obvious. Mimi nikaona Meru tukachukua msana kaleta one care kamaliza na msana wangu nikaoa nikaweka tukaenda msuni vijana ndio ndenga meru kama 1981 1981 nilikuwa langata barracks nikiwa kaisa alikuwa amewachia mimi kikosi ya big company huyu helen alikuwa anaenda university of nairobi hapo udili inaitwa kenya school of law naye akamaliza msana akamaliza huyu mjito kumaliza Kaiseri akasema Nairobi sio vijana peke yake hata wazee. Akajibu haraka tukafanya harusi nikiwa huko tena ye alikuwa anajua Mugambi tu ndio best man. Lakini kamwambia mimi nataka kuwa more than best man. Because wa Masai wameanza kuja 3 days. 
kabila siku hiyo na mimi naona wanakuja hapa wakakuja mimi nilikuwa na nyumba huko barracks wakakuja wakajaa barracks wasai kutoka kajiado wakajaa kwangu tukafanya harusi ya mama Helen naye tukaokolea yeye asinyang'anywa na hawa wanaume sasa wacha niruke 13 years 1994 unasikia sasa 1991 1994 tulikuwa tumesomesha jeshi mambo ya security mambo ya intelligence nilikuwa kamanda ya school of military intelligence in Kenya Jaron Kasira alikuwa anasoma intelligence kwa state house sasa mimi alikuwa nakuja jioni mimi namuonyesha kidogo na nampea vitabu anarudi state house gonzo rafiki yangu na yeye akuja shule because masomo yake yalikuwa tofauti lakini lazima asome hiyo yangu. Sasa mimi wakati nitoshaka nimesoma, nimesomesha jeshi mzima, na sasa kusema kwa nini nilikuwa nafanya kazi ya intelligence, nitarudi nyuma na sitaki. Sasa mimi nikasema wacha nijaribu mambo kwa raia, juraia poko na problem ya security. My vision for citizen participation in security was in 1994. Hiyo naona inaitwa nyumba kumi basi mimi nikaenda kwenda kajerunga iseri kwa nyumba tu, alikuwa anakaa baraka hata yeye hapa langata na mimi ya nyumba yangu nikaingia nikamwambia unajua mimi naenda jerunga iseri alikasirika ile jai ona hiyo ndio siku in 43 years jerunga iseri amekasirika na mimi mimi jai kasirika na yeye <laughs> anakamata mimi shingo anakamata mimi kichwa mimi nikajua hii mtu ataniua unajua masai <laughs> Masai wana wakiwa ngombe wanakamata wana shingo na, na pembe. Ikajua <laughs> hii mtu ataniua. Huyu mama huyu kwa mlango wa nyumba yao. Alimwambia ni nini unafanya FC? Patana na FC. Akuzikia sauti ya mwanamke akaniwacha. Nafikiri wa Masai mnaheshimu. Mnaheshimu wanawake sana. Basi mimi nikaenda. Nikaungana huko, nikaanza mambo ya community policing. 23 years kina kimenia tuko na wao akina deputy PS usia tukaenda tukaandika policy ya community policy ile which was my vision tukafanya tukamaliza sasa mimi na Kaiseri tunaonana tu akiwa jeshi tunaonana tunaonana lakini sasa kipindilia sana juu mimi wanaweza sema mimi nataka kumharibu mji wa siasa Kaiseri naye in 1902 the same vision akatoka akauliza akatoka tulikuja hapa ku launch yeye aliniambia ni shule lakini mimi siko na ikiwa shule niliona kama hapa <laughs> president moi alikuwa hapa tu tuka launch yeye akaingia jiasa akashinda aka, aka first term second term third term let's go to 2014 nimeruka tafadhali <laughs> 2014 Jenu Kaisiri rais rais Kenyatta Uhuru Kenyatta amempea cabinet secretary tuko pamoja every time akiwa MP tuko pamoja tuki wapi tuko pamoja akampea mimi tuko na yeye wakati anapewa acha kaniambia wewe kano utakuwa pia yangu kamwambia unataka niwe pia ndio na public service haikubali mtu over 60 kasema ai ni kweli kamaambia siwezi ningependa lakini over 60 mimi iko mimi na wewe ni wazee lakini wewe umepewa appointment na president hakuna mtu anauliza wewe <laughs> kaniambia basi utakuwa private private assistant <laughs> mimi nikakupea alikuwa private assistant <laughs> kam hapo president Kenya uh, Kenyatta alikuwa amesema kila mwananchi wa Kenya anakaa Kenya madaraka day in 2013 atahimiza community policing usalama iwe ni wananchi ni kweli urongo kazema hiyo kila mwananchi in Kenya community policing na kila mwananchi aizimize citizen participation in security nyumba kumi sasa ndio 
President akampea amri akamwambia sasa ile mlitengeneza hapo mbele 2014 hapo mbele hiyo hiyo ni 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 road map niliambia wale wengu akatengeneza road map sasa wewe nataka utengeneze hiyo kamati sawa sawa kuna kazi ya kampia president sawa kanambia mgambi wewe nataka wewe because wewe ni security consultant uingie hiyo kamati na wengine 12 na chairman tukaingia citizen participation security sasa akaniambia unaona sasa tumeingia kwa serikali sitakuwa navunja amri wewe ni private assistant wewe ni strategic security officer yangu na sasa wewe utakuwa nakaa na mimi na security detail si ni sasa sawa nikamwambia ndio sasa sawa fundi mimi nimetrainiwa mambo hata bunduki kaendelea kaendelea every day every day every day kazi yake alikuwa anamalizia tukiwa pamoja jioni juu mchana huko Harambee house ni wananchi ni kazi ya serikali ya juu ingine lakini hapa usiku tuko kwa lunch sisi wawili miaka hiyo yote hakuna mtu ameingia hiyo room tuko kaisera anamaliza kazi sasa kusema hata alikuwa anaongea na nani lakini mimi nilikuwa najua anaongea na nani na anafanya nini every account commissioner lazima apate simu ya kaisera usiku tukimaliza akae anaenda kuna news nyumbani saa tatu mimi news nyumbani saa tatu now siku hiyo tarehe saba tuko pamoja mimi nakunywa chai yeye nakunywa anakunywa ngabia nakunywa bia moja na hii bia nkaisere yeye bana funguliwa na mtu yeye na kifuniko yake anafungua mimi hata mimi simfunguli si hakuna wait anamfungulia na alikuwa na furaha anaenda following day arambe kajado akanambia sunday juu bomasi inafungwa sasa utakuja klabu yako nikama nikaenda nikatengeneza klabu yangu ikakuwa mzuri nikasema jendo akija hapa tutakuwa na kana ya hapa nikatafuta tv kaambia mshana yangu tafuta mimi tv iko na digital <laughs> tunoka mbili anaandaka hii chano anatoka hii chano anaenda chano naenda hii chano naenda hii sasa mimi lazima nikasema ile ya club inayoparitiwa kwa counter haitawezekana kaambia mshana yangu niletee mimi tv yako tuweke hapa siku hiyo usiku kuta tun nai yeye yeah, naenda mimi naenda mimi napata saa sita na saa saba simu kutoka wa security detail yetu afande ongea na sergeant mutea mutea ni wakati nyumbani ni mumeru lakini yule mwingine fikiri masai angeweza kuniambia na kimasai sasa mutea akaniambia afande mchoa haraka mchoa haraka means come quickly mchoa haraka ina habari kauliza hivyo mko wapi lazima tuko Karen ai nikajua yule mzee amegonjeka nikachukua gari kamsha mbibi yangu nikamwambia mimi naenda jero nkaseni hapana iko sawa Karen hospital sasa hiyo mimi nikienda nafikiria nitampeleka Nairobi hospital because alikuwa anapenda Nairobi hospital sana lakini sijui daktari yake sasa mimi nampenda daktari wangu niite mmoja atungoje because this is my friend the best friend i've ever had for 43 years mimi nikaenda with a lot of courage tamweka kwa gari yangu twende kwenda mimi nakuta madam helen analalia huyu mzee hapa ala mimi namwambia mimi nauliza daktari iko namna gani anasema ayuko namwambia it's unbelievable mimi mimi nimeata siku kubali hata hii mama niongereshe mimi nauliza nkaisede kifua aipigi na iko baridi kidogo ai hata mimi nikakubali hii mambo ni mbaya sasa kichwani akaniambia whom do i tell huyu ni property ya serikali whom do i tell president of the republic of kenya jo number one kaenda kwa simu mimi sina namba ya president kaisera alikuwa naye na mimi naona anaongea na yeye lakini siku muuliza lete namba because uweze kumuuliza lete namba ya president hata <laughs> ya IG akonai hakuna namba ana lakini mimi simuulizi because mimi nilikuwa security kaenda nikaona iko ofisi yangu moja ni training intelligence na huyu ataniitika 
nikampigia na najua atafikisha message nikampigia mkubwa kamwambia sa jana nikasema yuko na ningependa hii report in confidence ifikie president aliniambia namwambia tafadhali akaniambia kana mgambi hii report itakwenda saa nane ya usiku mimi nikaenda nikakaa chini siku nilileta dakika tano nikaona IG IG and his two deputies wakakuja sasa nikasema basi mimi na handover property ya wenyewe IG nikamwambia ndio huyu nikampeana briefing ndio yeah. lakini tulifanyika mama Helen niko wako na watoto wako tukachukua mili ya jenu kaisiri tukapeleka hii fiume iko kitu kingine urafiki naweza kufanya kuliko hiyo si sawa Mungu amweke malipo